Okay guys, what's going on? My name is Mr. Just Kitten, and then today I'm going to show you how to download the Aether mod for the 1.7.3 update of Minecraft. Uh, right off the bat, before you start out, you're going to need WinRAR. I'll link it in the description. It's used to open up the files, and there's three files you're going to need to download before you can actually download the Aether mod and make it work. Okay, so you need to download Mod Loader, Audio Mod, and Shock AHPI. Download all those before you download the Aether mod itself because without these, this mod won't work. So you click the Aether mod, you click all of them, and it will take you to where they are found. And then you you keep going and you s skip add. Uh, I already have them downloaded, but you would click start download. And when, when uh, you get them all downloaded, uh, they will they will be in folders mod loader audio mod shock HPI R5 either mod and I use too many items just to show you guys really quick how to make the portal and everything but okay to start off after you have all of the, these they should look like this you don't need uh, too many items by the way but you type in percent app data percent percent and it'll bring you up with a file folder dot minecraft click it go to your bin go to your minecraft jar file it's located in the bin uh... before the, i started the video i did a force update so everything is clean for on my minecraft so it'll bring you up with this you open up my loader so it's taking a second you grab all these files, drop them into the white space, hit OK, and you're done with this. Go to Audio Mod, grab all these files, drag them in, hit OK, and you're done with Audio Mod. Shock HPI, it is a little different. You need to go to the bin and then grab all the files. Drag them in, and now you are done with this. Now you actually have to open up the Aether mod itself. You go to the jar, you grab all of these files, there's a lot of them in this one. Drop them in, hit OK. And no, you are not done with the Aether mod just yet. First, before, after you get all of that stuff done, delete meta inf. Delete it or the mod won't work. Nothing, no mods work with the meta inf in there. Okay, so now meta inf is gone. Okay, so I'm just going to exit out. Go back to your bin. Go back. Go to your um, resources file folder. And there will be a folder called mod delete it yes delete that and then go back to your Aether mod and there's a also another folder called resources you click it there's a folder called mod you drag and drop and it is all good to go I'm gonna quickly put in too many items so I can uh, show you guys had the portal and everything so you know it's all legit it's only take a second. There's my Minecraft jar. Too many items also. It's it's also very, very easy to install. So you just drag and drop. Now I note you do not have to have too many items, but I like to use it. Okay, so you should be you're done all done with all that stuff. Okay. So open up your Minecraft. C 1.7.3 logging in now if you make it past this without black screen if that it is it black screens then you haven't deleted the meta inf or something okay so if it hasn't black screen that it's going good yep it worked so single player 
I'll just uh, pick a glacier and see look it gives you tips now pro tips and look I think I'm ascending from the sky I believe because I've yep I've had the either the either my on this before and this is what it looks like it looks like this it's pretty neat thanks guys for watching uh, if this helped you leave it a like uh, favorite it subscribe if you want to see more and yeah see you guys oh geez